Hello and welcome back to my channel. So <clears throat> today I wanted to talk to you about novellas, um, but more specifically, um, I have a question. So these are my thoughts, and um, <clears throat> sorry, I have a bad cough at the moment. These are my thoughts, but um, I just kind of wanted to put this video up to kind of, I don't really know, to kind of like, not rant, but kind of muse out loud to you guys and see maybe what you guys think so basically i have um i have my own goodreads as most people on booktube do um and i have set my reading goal this year of uh 40 books um but i noticed something when i was reading and uploading my progress and stuff on goodreads which is that um I'm not sure whether I should be counting novellas towards my book count on Goodreads. Uh, so basically, I have three novellas here. Um, this is Haunting of Tramcar 15, uh, The Test, and Vigilance. Um, I've already read Vigilance, I haven't read these two. Um, but these are all under 200 pages. Um, and... I've read Vigilance, um, again, under 200 pages, but obviously I kept updating Goodreads, and then when I finished, my progress was also updated on Goodreads because I'd finished it. But I kind of felt guilty because most of the books I read are at least over 300, if not over 400 pages. For instance, Scythe, which I finished probably a couple of weeks ago, is over 400 pages, so to me, this counts on Goodreads. But, I'm not sure if if these do. This is the shortest one I've got. This is like 150 pages. But, yeah. Like, I understand that, yes, I'm reading it. And, yes, I'm digesting it. And, yes, I'm forming my own opinion of it. And all that stuff. Which is kind of the point of reading. But, I just don't know. I'm not... I don't really mean I feel guilty. I just kind of feel like... A bit of a... A bit of a loss. Like, even, even a page... Uh, if even a page, even a book, just over 200 pages, like, I recently finished, uh, My Sister the Serial Killer, by, uh, a Yink and Braithwaite, and that was, like, 230 pages, and even to me, I felt a little bit guilty, um, counting that towards my 40 books this year, Goodreads goal, um, so, that's it, really, I just kind of wanted to get that out there, and, um, see what your guys' opinion, opinions are, if any, because, you know, like my viewership here on booktube um and everybody that follows me on instagram and um goodreads you know you guys mean a lot and your opinions also mean a lot to me whether you read it or not um so yeah that's what i wanted to ask really because also i want to read some other books i have some like i have a box set of goosebumps books by rl stein and we all know most of them are under 100 pages so I just wanted to know whether I, you know, whether I should maybe wait till I've read two or three of them, um, and then count that towards my goal, um, or whether I should just read them all individually and count them towards it. Um, I think maybe, I don't know, what I've been thinking about trying to do is every time I read a book that's under 200 pages, um, or well, under 250 pages, I'm thinking about adding another one to my Goodreads reading goal. I know that means it will change all the time, so it'll be, one minute it'll be 40 books, then it'll be 42 books, then it'll be 56 books, then it'll, I don't know, but that's what I'm thinking of doing. Um, or should I just keep it at 40 and keep reading the ones that are under 200 pages? I'm, I'm kind of at a loss. Um, so I'd like your opinions, if you don't mind. Um, <coughs> yeah. Comment down below and let me know what you think, um, because it would really help me out. Uh, yeah, thank you for watching this video. Um, if you liked it, please click, please click like. If you haven't already, please subscribe. You can follow me on Goodreads, just look for Lee Johnson. And you can follow my bookstagram, uh, just search Bookish Trances. And I will see you all again very soon. In fact, extremely soon, because behind you, right here is a stack of books because I have another book haul. So that video will be up later today. So thank you for watching and I will see you all again very soon. Goodbye.